As we've told you, News 19's Amy DuPont recently traveled with a team from Gunderson Lutheran to the Pine Ridge Indian Reservation in South Dakota. The team provides free health care in the village of Porcupine, a few miles from the historic site of Wounded Knee. The clinic they work in is primitive, but the doctors and nurses are able to work around the conditions to provide quality care. We explain in our exclusive series, Healers at Wounded Knee. We gotta go check your weight, but we're not gonna take those diapers off quite yet. That's a fella. Kathy Wessels is a people person. Seven pounds and eight ounces. The registered nurse enjoys talking with her patients as much as healing them and jumped at the opportunity to provide care to the underserved population in Porcupine, South Dakota. We're really having to work hard here, <laughs> as far as here, uh, but yeah, that's pretty cool. Problem solving is as much a part of providing care here as the medicine itself. How do you make do when you don't have what you need? The clinic is primitive. Unlike the facilities these doctors and nurses work in back home, there's no lab, no x-ray machine and few medical supplies. Every day comes um, things that we don't have and that we need to get and, and supplies that would make um, caring for people easier. Simple supplies you can find in any store in La Crosse. This little boy came to the clinic with a fever and diarrhea. He wouldn't drink milk or water and was dehydrated. Dr. Ree wanted to give the toddler Pedialyte, only they don't stock it at the clinic and it's not sold at the only store in town. So, Dr. Ree went online and found a recipe. And so we made some here at the clinic just to get the child started and then we're able to purchase Pedialyte for the mom. Doing more with less is the Gunderson team's motto. It's very, you know, basic examination skills, um, you know, really trying to figure out what's really important, um, you know, what's going to make a difference in their health. Word of the team's hard work is spreading through the Porcupine community. According to local reporter Rosanna Renault, patients appreciate their compassion. It's all positive. It's all positive. We'd like to keep them here permanently. Gunderson Lutheran has pledged to staff this clinic for one week each month for as long as the tribe asks them to. Nurse Kathy Wessels and the rest of this team have already signed up to volunteer again together next year. You know, you're never quite prepared, but um, you know, it's great. It's, it's what we're here for. The Gunderson team also relies on their co-workers in La Crosse for help. Back home, Dr. Reed treats adults only. While in Porcupine, a mother brought her one-week-old son to the clinic for a well baby check. Dr. Reed had never performed one, but thanks to the pediatric physician on call in La Crosse, she was able to perform the exam. The baby is healthy and doing well.